Hi, I'm Lindsay Corcoran from TheDailyShrewsbury.com and this is your weekly news. Welcome to Shrewsbury News. Brought to you by TheDailyShrewsbury.com. Board of Selectmen sent a letter to Governor Deval Patrick on Tuesday to encourage him to sign the health insurance reform bill, passed as is, without allowing additional amendments that could cost the town as much as $130,000. The municipal health insurance reform package was adopted by the state House and Senate last week. Before its passage, Selectmen in Shrewsbury were appealing to local representatives to ensure that the bill wouldn't hurt Shrewsbury. An amendment made in the Senate threatened to cost the town $130,000. To read more, visit thedailyshrewsbury.com. Hundreds of Shrewsbury residents flocked to Dean Park to celebrate the 4th of July with the town's annual family fun-filled event on Monday afternoon. Shrewsbury Parks and Recreation Director Angela Snell said the event typically draws over 500 residents, ranging from children who enjoy the inflatable moon bounces, face painting, and a decorated bike and doll carriage parade to adults who picnic in the park. The monthly public access show, Ask the Manager, will feature local reporters, including myself, posing questions to town manager Dan Morgado. The show is held monthly with host Donna O'Connor and her guests, who are not announced to Morgado prior to filming, asking questions on policies and concerns for the town. This month, O'Connor invited all the local reporters in town to attend and ask questions for the hour-long show. Two attended and peppered Morgado with questions on everything from sewer rates to economic expansion to his potential retirement in four years. The show will air on SGTV Channel 30 throughout the month of July. Exact viewing times can be found online at the Shrewsbury Media Connections, Connections page on the town website. Three, two, one, and lift off. Don't miss out on your chance to watch History in the Making. NASA coverage of Space Shuttle Atlantis Final Flight, live on SCTV Channel 29. physical response. It's an organic thing. Color's like an extra emotion. It's a learned experience. It's alive. Shrewsbury's newest theater group, Center Stage Productions, will be debuting their first production ever this weekend with two performances of You're in Town the Musical. Center Stage Productions formed this year in an attempt to provide local young actors with the professional experience of putting on a production with just two weeks of rehearsal time. You're in Town will be showing this Saturday and Sunday. For show times and to learn how to purchase tickets, visit thedailyshoesbury.com. Construction is continuing at a fast pace for the first Wegman store in New England, which is set to open at Northborough Crossing on October 16th. After months of fundraising and a lot of help from the Shrewsbury community, Students from the Leaders of Tomorrow group at Shrewsbury High School were finally able to place a bench at the Cyprian Keys Golf Club in memory of their friend Andy Reese. Reese was 16 and a junior at Shrewsbury High School when he died on December 7, 2010, after his car struck a tree in Boylston head-on. The group began fundraising earlier this year, seeking $1,000 to buy a wooden bench and a plaque, and last month their vision came to life when the bench was installed at the golf course. On Friday, July 15th and Saturday, July 16th from noon to 6 p.m., Price Chopper will be selling hot dogs and refreshments in the parking lot to benefit the rebuild of the Patton Elementary School playground. In March, the playground at the Patton Elementary School was taken down due to safety concerns, leaving the school and children without an outdoor recreation space. Estimates to rebuild the playground are between $50,000 and $75,000. 
Price Chopper has already run a pizza promotion and a pin-up program that have raised close to $10,000 and includes a $5,000 match from Price Chopper Corporate. Find out more about how to donate to the cause by visiting thedailyshrewsbury.com. I'm Lindsay Corcoran and this has been your weekly news. To see these stories and much more, visit thedailyshrewsbury.com. Be sure to tune into SPAC 28 again next Thursday at 7 and 10 p.m. Thanks for watching.